The United States is sending a crewed spaceship to the moon for the first time in more than 50 years, and San Diego is playing a key role. The Orion test capsule is at Naval Base San Diego, along with the astronauts it will carry. CBS 8's Jasmine Ramirez has more on the tests they're involved with ahead of the Artemis 2 mission. The astronauts will be returning to Earth in a space capsule and splashing down right off of our coast. Then a ship similar to the one you see behind me will be going out to get them. Artemis 2 will take four astronauts on a 10 day mission around the moon. And we're excited to be the first crew in over 50 years to go out to the moon and back. This will also mark the first time we will see a woman and a black astronaut step foot on the moon. All the different things that are going to be a, a first in this mission, it doesn't matter if you're a first if there's no second, thirds, and fourths. And so that's really what I think about is making sure that we do the best at our job so that the American people and our international partners continue to have faith. When crews return to Earth, the U.S. Navy will be helping them with teams of sailors, ships, and helicopters. They'll retrieve the capsule after making splashdown 60 miles off the coast. That's expected to happen between Catalina Island and San Clemente. This is crazy. This is the stuff of, of, uh, of movies, and we're living it every day. Um, I'm lucky because I get to fly with three of the greatest human beings I've ever met in my life. The ultimate goal of Artemis is to prepare for human expeditions on Mars. The astronauts shared what it means to them. Answering some of those fundamental questions that we all have about ourselves. What does it mean to be human? Are we alone in the universe? How do we all get here? Those are the questions that we can answer in places like the moon and on Mars. NASA says Artemis 2 is set to happen in September 2025. Artemis 3 is planned for 2028 with crews touching down on the moon. Jasmine Ramirez, CBS 8.